Hey y'all, I'm gonna show you how to do a broken doll makeup tutorial. What you need are crayons, any color really, cream makeup, black and white, a brush, brushes for eyeshadow and stuff, a hair tie if you have long hair, eyeshadow, and contact lenses if you have them. I have one, I'm gonna use that. I'm lining my face right now to show you what I'm gonna do with my face to show what is gonna be white and what is gonna be black. I am filling in my face with white right now because most of my face is going to be the doll. So dolls are white, aren't they? Yeah, I think they are. And you're just going to go on your eyebrow because if your eyebrow is dark, especially, you're going to need to really get on there. Now with my black crayon, I'm going to line my face to show what's going to be black. And what's going to be white, the other side that is not white is going to be all black like my face is broken in half. That's fun, isn't it? Now I'm going to shape my lips with the red crayon. And usually dolls' lips, they are always small. So I'm just going to make it kind of like a heart. And now I'm going to paint my other half of my face black like that part is broken. And now I'm going to make my eyebrow and it's kind of going to be cartoonized because doll's eyebrows aren't usually realistic so I'm going to make it like I'm kind of surprised. And I'm going to line my lips. You don't have to do this part but I think it looks better when you do. I think it looks more dolly. Dolly? Is that the word? Yeah. Once you're done with that, you can just add more detail. I'm just going to go over my eyebrow one more time because I still think I can see it. And then line where I think I need more detail on the black so it doesn't look so fake. Blend that. And now I'm going to line my eyeball like it is bigger and more round, like a doll. You don't have to do that with the other eye because there is no other eye because it's all black so then you're gonna fill it in with white like it's the white of your eyeball and once you're satisfied with how white it is just leave it like that it's gonna look like your eye is a lot bigger than it really is then you're gonna line your eye on the top like it's connecting so it doesn't look so fake like realistic then add fake eyelashes if you have fake eyelashes and then make more detail on it I added a fake eyelash on the bottom but later on in the video you see that I take it out because I didn't think it was very necessary and I didn't really like how it felt so I took it, took it off and now I'm putting eyeshadow on the top of my eye make myself look more pretty right and then I'm gonna add cracks all over my face where mostly where the black starts that's where the cracks all should be to make it look real cool and I'm gonna add a big crack on my cheek on the other side just to even it all out you can do as many cracks as you want, as big as you want, as small as you want, it doesn't matter. If you add smaller cracks around the big crack, I think it looks a little more realistic and better. So that's just a tip for this makeup. You can do it darker and lighter in some places like I did or dark on all of the cracks or light on all of them. I don't know. It's your choice. And once you're done doing all of your cracks that you are pleased with then just add a little bit of detail on all of your face and you're done and add the contact and you're done 
and I think it looks pretty good. I think I look like a doll kind of, you know? A broken one, if you close your eye, it looks even better. And I just added a ponytail, like a doll. Or you can do two, like in this one. Like and subscribe for more, and I will see you soon. Bye!